in the next few hours as conditions begin to change here on the West Coast. We'll go across the country now with your nationwide forecast. And of course, the ridge over the West Coast is collapsing due to the sort of swirling low that's diving down across the central part of the province. And the tail end of that bringing us a few showers, a few flurries mixed for today with minimal accumulations over some of the higher terrain in parts of the lower mainland. Considerably more snowfall across Alberta and Edmonton, also down to Calgary. Temperatures plunging well below zero in Alberta, as they will across the central prairies with mostly light snowflakes across Regina into Winnipeg as well. Now for southern uh, uh, Ontario, very few flurries. A couple this morning, then they taper off. The sun may come out, but you're just below freezing. The much colder air is trapped into uh, Quebec, where it's going to be minus 13 today with some lingering snowflakes. Toronto right around the zero mark, a little bit cooler in parts of Ottawa, and we're in the teens below zero for Winnipeg, Regina, and Edmonton. I'd say for Calgary, about minus six today. And again, a fair number of snow flurries throughout the day, but not quite as cold in the southern sections of Alberta. And for Metro Vancouver, we're aiming for four degrees onto the high side of zero. It takes a while to get there. So for the next several hours, this uh, thicker layer of cloud coming in right here in the dark blue, bringing us some showers and flurries mixed and minimal accumulations of snowfall. Then it blows on by at the end of the day and it clears tonight. So tonight's low is minus three. Tomorrow it clouds over. It's dry during the day. We are advertising a developing winter storm. And I, I have to be quite honest, we're not really sure how much of it will fall as rain or snow. The warmer air comes in a loft. The colder air is trapped down beneath and we make it a lot of freezing rain on Sunday. Very slick conditions on, on the roads on Sunday, trending towards milder and rainy conditions early next week. By Tuesday, at least a half a dozen degrees and that will be in the rain.